Yo, what's going on? It's D-Man bringing to you some EA Sports UFC 4. Today we're jumping online with Megan Anderson. Did I say? I think him. Oh, that's crazy. People are going to be on my head, bro. It just hit me. I was saying Megan. <laughs> I think <laughs> when I was using uh, Amanda. Oh, well, it is what it is. But we're jumping online with Megan Anderson. Um, We're going to box a lot. <laughs> Her stand up is pretty good. Uh, what I really want to utilize is her reach. She's six feet tall um, with a 72 inch reach. So compared to everybody else <laughs> in this division, she has some pretty long limbs. We're going to try to manage our distance in this session. Like I said, I'm just trying to get better at UFC 4. So let's go ahead and get into it. All right, so we have a UFC 259 matchup. Let me know who you have in the comments below, Amanda or Megan. Man, Amanda is so tough, so tough. But we'll see though, we'll see. Oh, wow. Oh, she's kicking too. I have a hard time dealing with, with kickers, man. I really do. I should just check them, but sometimes it's just, for me, it's not that easy, man. Or maybe it is. But we see her game plan early. <laughs> we see that she wants to kick the legs out. There we go. We check one. That might be my only one of the fight, but at least we did that. There we go. We get a drop. Oh, man. I really did not mean to dive in. I always say it. Like, Amanda off her back is pretty good. And you, you definitely don't want to be there. But we'll see. We'll see. I'll test, I'll test my opponent out really quick. Let me see what the ground game is looking like. Oh, I thought I, dang, I thought I was on that. All good. Uh-oh. Get out the way. Overhand landed. Yo, I will say the boxing of Anderson feels super crisp. Super crisp. I like it. Because you, you play with some boxers on UFC 4, and it's like, it doesn't, oh, shit. It doesn't feel that great, to be honest. But Anderson, Amanda, like, their hands are valid. <laughs> oh, it's so weird fighting people like this, bro. So weird. It's like they, I don't know. You check that. It, 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 I, I don't know. It's just weird to me. Oh, she's got a fantastic jab. I'm telling you, put me to put me to shame. I like to try to fight behind my jab, but I'm not sure I've ever landed him so consistently. As like I know, if I fought like Jermaine Durand, oh, right those fighters do the same thing. Oh, All right. So she's not kicking with that leg anymore. There we go. Oh, if I had 10 more seconds, 10 more. So we injured her right leg because she was kicking so much. If you check like two or three of them, they're, they're rot to the legs. So I will say I, I'll take round one for sure. Oh, rot already. Oh my goodness, bro. Yo. Oh, the power takedown. If I had, if I had a little bit more power, that would have been a fight. She was eating those punches like a buffet. Yeah, I'll take a hook, uh, uppercut. Let me get a couple of those. 
overhand gotta grab that. All you can eat. Great movement that she's showing on the ground. Oh, nice strike on the ground for Let me actually focus up here because I might be in trouble. Like I said, off off the bat, I don't know how Anderson really is on UFC four that is, so Oh man, she got the top mount way too easily. You eat those. All right. Those transitions are going way too slow. I don't like that. Uh oh. I might be in trouble. That is. Oh man, that's weird. People usually don't go like right the top mount like that. Am I tripping? Oh, she denied it. Good one. You're tough if you deny that. Let me remember, she's going down to hit top mount. Postured up to get the top mount. Okay. You might be in trouble. We deny that one. Just over two minutes to go. Ooh, if she kept hooking, I had no more stamina to block. If she kept hooking, that would have been it. In these situations, I know, like, I know it can be annoying. But I, I think that you just have to be patient, defend yourself. I know it looks like a lot of time is on the clock, but you just try to make it to the next round because obviously, like, I don't think I'm getting back to my feet, to be honest. Those transitions are way too slow. Amanda Nunez is way too good. And my opponent definitely knows what he's doing. So we have to be careful. We have about 40 seconds. There we go. Just don't get hit. Simple. He's going to steal this. Well, not even steal the round. He's going to take this round easy. Finally win side control. Postured up. We can so block those easily. The thing is, I was not expecting that takedown. Hey, Amanda was getting tagged up on her feet. That was a good round, too, by my opponent. I'm not even going to cap. Uh, I can't talk trash. I can't say a joke. I got beat up in round two, all right? Round three, I have to keep landing and um, be ready for that takedown. Uh oh. Oh, nice shot to the body connects for her that, there. That cage work. We didn't see a lot of body work from her. You have to watch out for it. But she is getting after it now. On the feet, all she has is that leg kick. kick. That's it. Again, as usual, really as well a fighter as we that right there, that calf kick. Yeah, regardless of gender, right? Regardless of gender, Amanda Nunes stands amongst. But I'm not too worried about that. She is scoring points, but. So a nice job by her there. I mean, I, I don't know. Good job raising those Overhand landed. If she would have done this in the first place, she wouldn't be dealing with the right. cut that she's dealing with now. But now that she's but it's like she's cut, only she trying to land that, that so that's why it's weird. To that eye. Beautiful strike. Combination lands for her there. She would seem to be in the zone. I'm on that. that. Stop. Stop. I like that. Yes, she's in the zone. She everything. Oh, that one super early. Oh, I thought I denied that. That is super tough. Because I know that's what she wants. She wants to take down. How good is her movement here on the We're in a good situation right here. I don't mind sprawl. Denied that one. Yeah, she's so good transitions and movement. Her ability is unmatched. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. I should have stood up. I tried to throw an elbow. I might end up paying for it. Yeah, no, nah, we're good right here. All right, you back on the, the feet. Got downloaded in own round own two. You got downloaded. Cover. That's tough. Now I can switch up and I'll, I'll be all right. Oh, maybe you not.
Good shot to the body. Uh oh, dropped. Dropped again. Uh huh. Hey, with the hands. Ah oh, man, as soon as, <laughs> as soon as I start talking, bro, then I won. As soon as I start talking, like I said, on the feet, man, like just landing that leg kick, that probably won't get it done. She wants the top mount so badly that I don't know, like, you have control, but how many shots are you landing? On? That's my thing. Then again, I really don't know how judging goes. That's my first time going to a decision online. I mean, great fight. Definitely a great fight. Let me see who won, though. Man, that last one was a war, bruh. Honestly, like... I'm not gonna lie, I'm kind of surprised I won that one, <laughs> for real. So now we have Cyborg up next. A lot of people pick Cyborg in this division, more than Amanda. And that's surprising to be honest, or maybe not. Personally, I think Cyborg is a little bit too, too clunky for me to use on UFC 4. I tried a few times, wasn't really, wasn't really for me. Look, she's throwing that right hand out. What's going on? Am I being trolled? Let's find out. Look, right, right, right. Look, what? What's going on? What is it? Hello? Poor counter, D-Man. All right. <laughs> I'm being trolled, all right? It happens from time to time. But apparently I'm fighting uh, one punch man. Look, look, stop it. Oh my goodness, bro. Yo, the hands are crazy. I'm not going to lie. Oh my, yo, the hands are crazy. The combos, look, look. What a All right, that was a troll match. It happens. Okay, it happens. People are like, yo, you don't fight anybody good. I fight, I fight decent people, okay? I don't always show like the player cards, but they play ranked and then they just try to ego boost and quick fight. But no, nah, that match right there, yeah, yeah, that was a troll match for sure. <laughs> One punch, man. Somebody come look at this. Come look, look. David versus Goliath. Why would you pick Jessica? Look! <laughs> what? Why? Anderson is six feet tall. Jessica might be five foot, five foot one. Maybe. Have a whole ruler on this woman. Bro, this, this looks hilarious, bro. Nope. <laughs> That's just my baby doggy. Looks weird. Let me see if I can stop. Stop. Let me see if I can land. That high difference is hilarious, though, because like Megan, she's just going to. She's going to windmill punches down at you. Have you seen a fight like that in real life? Like at school or something? It's always a little dude messing with somebody that's not in his weight class. Not in his height class. Or, you know what? Weight and height doesn't even matter. He's just not in his fight class and he's little. And the big dude just starts windmilling punches down at him. It's like, bro, what do you do in that situation? I guess you just shut up and don't get into a fight in the first place. 
And I'm not talking about like if you're getting bullied. Like I say, defend yourself. Swing on them. But hey, I've known some short people that just talk a lot, bro. And I say, hey, you probably don't want to do that, and they keep doing it. Next thing you know, windmill punches. It's like that's what you get. Oh my! Hold that. I feel like if I go for, <laughs> man, she <laughs> she actually landed that jumping kick. I feel like if I go for a body knee, it will convert into a regular knee to the head. Man, that's tough. I could sweat a little bit and just keep her out, but man, I I don't know why you would go at that pick in this division. Stop it. She's in my grill. I like it. I like it. Overhand. I can land that overhand from a mile away with, with Anderson, man. <laughs> Go ahead and have a seat. She's getting folded up like a roly poly. Just curling up. Nope. Mm -mm. Block that. Nice. <laughs> Another uppercut. I feel like a big old bully right now, man. This doesn't feel right. It's like an adult versus a kid right now. Yeah, go ahead and end it, man. That that fight did not feel right at all. Six foot versus five foot. Oh, man, that's super tough. I'm having fun, though. I'm getting trolled a little bit, but her hands are super tough. Like her combos and her moveset is pretty tough. All right, let's go ahead and get into it. We have Holly Holm. Apparently, I fought this guy before, but I don't. I really don't remember names, bro. I, I don't. All right. But I do know Holly Holm is. It's kind of like my kryptonite for some reason. It's somebody like that in every division, so it is what it is. But let me see what my opponent is about with Holly Holm. Leg kick. They're certainly getting after it early. Beautiful punch. That footwork, man. She she can get in well, and out really so quickly, bro. It is tough. And, and that length advantage and that and Anderson has over most people, it doesn't really apply to Holly Holm. Oh, beautiful kick by her it kind of does, but not... Foot. It's not as bad as the other fighters in this division. Man, she, hey, she is letting loose. I like it. I like it. Switching it up, throwing that roundhouse to the body, into the head. See, I thought I thought it was going down low, and I blocked low. That's my type of look right there. That's a good setup. I like that. I like seeing that. Oh, how is she standing? Brutal knee to the body. Clinching a little bit, but not spamming. I like it. Now hold on. Oh, went for the takedown. Tough. We eat those. Yo, Holly Holm got off to a nice start. A really nice start. Came through landing, put me on my back. Faking that transition. All right. Watch for the huge elbows that she's known for. All right, full guard now, DC, and just because she has the time, there we go. Does not mean she is not in there we go. Oh, she's one big takedown. Oh, 
her ground and pound is on point here. She's made this a focus going in to make these strikes count. Certainly doing that tonight. She's making each and every one of them count. Doing a very, very uh, good I should job. probably, I probably should have stood up right there, but we'll see. I'm on that. We'll see. It's weird because some people like they may not have the best ground stats, but you can still you can still grapple with them a little bit. You know what I mean? So I'm trying to see if Anderson is one of those people. Now I, I found out early that she can't go on the ground with Amanda Nunez, but with Holly Holm, we might we might be okay. Deny. Uh oh, couple shots landed. I'm not doing any damage though, but we're landing. That's always good. We deny that. I'm on that. I'm on that. There we go. Hey, sometimes, like sometimes, I'm shook. I'll be on that transition denial, and they do not give it to me. There we go. Yo, I might be all right. I might be all right on the ground in this fight. I like that. Uh oh. Oh, 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 big shots. Big shots. Hey, you better, you better cover up. Honestly, she should have stayed on her feet. Like she's bugging. She was tagging me up. But then she said, let's switch it up. Let's go to the ground. All right. That she's showing on the ground. On that. I'm on that. Come on now. I know you're tight. I know your body. I've been here before. Gonna fake everything. Just fake, fake, fake. Oh my goodness. Yeah, I like that. Yeah, I like that. Come on, man. Stop it. Great movement by her here on the ground, and she just does it so fluidly and so easily. It, it's really man. Exciting. I thought I denied that. You can tell that she's been a lifetime Those side control denials aren't that automatic on UFC move. 4 anymore. So little I miss it. I used to be cheesing in side control. Side control was more was more valuable than top mount. Staying busy from bottom position here. And with conviction, she moves right into half guard. Without much effort, nope. she was able to pass from her full guard right into Yeah, I already know. Round two, <laughs> he's staying on the feet. Just remember, he, he went for the takedown. He did this to himself. Obviously, I was getting tagged up. So if I do more damage on the ground, I'm staying on the ground. So, yeah, I'll definitely take that round. Bars, hold on, D-Man. Hold on. Hey, that, that's a good round, though, for real. That's a good round. Let me lock back in because, like I said, I fought this dude before. I don't remember when, but I need to let him know. It's like, yeah, I got this, man. I got this. It's not luck. It's not fluky. Go ahead and touch up. I respect it. Oh, land it. Holly Holm is definitely throwing that leg kick out there. People are doing that a lot today. That calf kick is so quick sometimes, man. But like I said, like if that's all you're doing, then I, I don't know. If that's all you're landing, I'm not really I'm not really stressed about it. Now those hands, those hands are dangerous for sure. Holly Holm is busted up. I like it. Leg kick, leg kick. I know it's on the way. Head kick. See? <laughs> Damn, man. Holly Holm is so tricky. She reminds me... I thought she was going to get tagged there. It's like fighting her on UFC 4 is kind of like fighting um, Wonder Boy. In my opinion. Like their styles on UFC 4 are kind of the same. 
Well, there's no denying her power. So I kind of fight them the same. I should put them on their back, but we'll see. Heavy leg kick. Oh, that's embarrassing. That's embarrassing. You're going to go order a sandwich. That allows your opponent to stay in the fight. Give him the entire combo. Watch out for that knee now. By the drink. Really put it on her. Go get her. Extend that combination. Be confident. Go and try to find something that's going to end this fight. And I'm going to admit send a few more strikes. I know you see the uppercut hook a lot. But that's because it's there, right? So that's why I'm throwing it. Sometimes I lead with the hook because she's leaning also. She's doing the minor lean, so. There we go. Let the hands go. What? I was in. Oh, my goodness. That up kick, bro. I thought I was in, bro. I thought I was I thought I was good. I guess not. All good. All good. Like I said, Holly, she's landing that leg kick. Uh-huh. But these hands are crazy though. Watch out for that knee. We check. I like it. Oh, the right hand is there for how about that shin? A little check hook. Okay. Oh man, people are kicking me today. Well, they don't let you wear headgear, but she. There we go. Uppercut hook. Oh, she tried the side kick. Hold on now. A Superman elbow? Okay. Hold on. She's trying to get into her Duffy, man. She's trying to get into her bag. I like it. I see that one. Damn. Did not do anything about it. Had to switch up and go southpaw. Save my leg for round three. Try to establish that jab. Uh-oh, don't go to the body. The uppercut is there. I told you. I tried to tell you. Yeah, she's ducking down a lot. That's why I'm spamming uppercuts right now. I'm trying to... Oh! I'm trying to make her make a mistake. Even though I almost made one. A big one. Oh, man. Kick, kick, kick. You have to land something other than that. <laughs> Maybe not. There you go. Head kick. Oh, that was beautiful. Hook. Rot. Oh, nothing to it. UFC 4, you got to rock with me, man. You have to let me get that. 20 seconds to go round two. Way to hide that leg. The goal fighters exchange in the pocket here. Let's get some offense. Let's get going. 10 seconds remain in round two. Oh, hell no. Nah. Superman elbow again. Go ahead and have a seat. End of the round, she tried to get. She tried to. Nah, that's over with. Hey. Hey, you can't. You can't do that at the end of the round. Because you never know what's going to happen. You know what I mean? Like, she tried to do something real funny, real cool at the end of the round. Simply because, you know, round three, I'll see you. Nah, it, it doesn't work like that all the time. You, you went for that Superman elbow, and you paid for it. You needed one more second to make it out. One more second, and you done goofed. I'll definitely take that W, bro. Man, I've had a few long fights with Anderson. So the video might be long. Once again, if the videos are too long, let me know, bro. Oh, watch out for Amanda. Amanda coming through with the hands. Uh-huh, me too, though. Me too. Me too. I can land also. Stop playing with me. She's doing a fantastic job. You love that flow state. I love it. The leg kick, the roundhouse to the body. All right. Low key, I'm going to just, I'm going to swing through it. All right. 
Bad idea. Maybe. We'll find out. One minute into the fight. Full on brawl. I mean, give us an ooh or something, man. ooh These two young ladies are really going after it. Beautiful. And I do want to keep her out, but she she keeps walking in. I respect it. She the She's trying to get into that phone booth. Right hand on point. Oh man, how about her hooks? <laughs> Swinging like hard. Kind of whiffing too, so I'm not I'm not too stressed. Oh, I tried to lean back. I thought I was good, man. I thought I was good. Stop that. Nope. Stop. Hey, I'm here. I'm here on the denials. You know what I mean? I'm here. I like I like when I'm able to deny stuff, man. Makes me happy. Bit shots to the body, to the head. Nope. Nope. You dove in. Nope. See, if I really wanted the submission right now, I would go for it. Real deal, no pickle. But I'm chilling. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Those body shots hurt, don't it? Oh, then you want to taunt. All right. All right, let's do it then. If you want to taunt, let's taunt. Do not quick when I get the taunting back. Let's do it then. If you want to be petty, I can be petty too. I told you I have petty graphic memory. Oh. Hold that. Yeah, and guess what? Yup. You did. Hey, you did it. You did it. Uh-uh. Every knockdown. Yup. Yeah, you don't like that, do you? Come on, man. Stop playing with my name. I know your body. You want a ton? I could do the same thing. So let's go ahead and get petty. All right, round two of the taunt war. Hey, everybody clap it up. Uh, I can't clap it up really quick. I'll clap it up at the end. Yup. Oh, that uppercut to the body. Oh, yeah. Go ahead and have a seat. Yup. <laughs> yup. Just remember, I did not start this, okay? I did not start it. Always remember that. I, I be chilling. I be chilling. And then people bring out the troll in me. She's trying to clinch up. All right. All right. Hold that. Ooh. Have a seat. You know what? I'm a. Once again, have a seat. Have a seat, man. Hey, that rad, <laughs> that rad doll knockout. You gotta watch out for it. That was like a double jump. She was, she was in 32 bit. Hey, Megan Anderson, you have the hands. I'm looking forward to watching her fight at UFC 259. I know Amanda is tough. Amanda is one of the greatest to do it. But I just want to see somebody apply some pressure. Like, damn, you all be easy. Thank you for watching. Peace.